If your doctor puts you on a PPI like pantoprazole or omeprazole, then you need to listen up. Now, most people get put on PPIs because of heartburn, indigestion, things like that, where they think that high levels of stomach acid are the cause. So they're put on a proton pump inhibitor to reduce stomach acid. Now, in the majority of cases, this does help if heartburn is your main issue. The problem is this just covers up the issues that are going on under the surface. I recently had a patient who came in who's been dealing with digestive issues for a long time. She was put on a PPI for over 20 years, and she was never given a plan to come off of it. The problem is if you look at the back of the box of a PPI, it says don't take this for longer than six to eight weeks because it, they know that it has negative impacts on digestion. Stomach acid is a very important part of the immune response. It's one of the first chemical barriers that we have to help uh, neutralize pathogens that come into the body. It's also one of the main things that's responsible for the breakdown of proteins in the body. So if we don't have enough stomach acid, we're not going to be able to break down proteins. We're going to open ourselves up to infections, and we're also not going to signal to the gallbladder and to the pancreas to produce their respective enzymes and bile salts that help with the digestion and absorption of carbohydrates and fats. Now, I ran a, a stool test on this patient so that we could get some further information, and this is what we saw. Tens across the board for things like maldigestion, dysbiosis, metabolism, imbalance and she had some infections in there as well. When we looked a little bit further, what we saw was a huge overgrowth in bacteria. We saw very little breakdown in digestion. She has exocrine pancreatic insufficiency where she's not able to break down carbohydrates. Her products of protein breakdown is extremely high. Her immune system is completely tanked and wiped out. Things like her beta glucuronidase are off the charts so we know that she can't detoxify things. Her gut is a mess and her doctor just told her that she needs to take a PPI and she'll be fine for the rest of her life to take that. It was covering up all of these really important things that were going on under the surface. Now we're going to start working on this stuff. We can start to reduce that beta glucuronidase level. We can start to support digestion. And if we can rebalance things, then she might have a chance of coming off of that PPI and not even having to deal with the heartburn anymore. So if you've been dealing with a PPI for a long time, drop stomach acid below. I'll send you my full video I did on heartburn and indigestion, and you'll get to kind of understand what goes on behind the scenes with heartburn.